Greetings, fellow Sumatories, and welcome to the stream. Also got a burp. Ugh. Excuse me. Dr. Pepper, still a good drink. Anyway, um, you want to play more sword, though? I want to play more sword, though. Still liking it. Even that really low-textured resolution Pokeball in those previous two shots right there. Well, three now, but looks good front four now, but what matters is I'm still enjoying this game. I'm really excited to play more, so yeah, let's get to it. Let's go for it! So yeah, to those who missed it, um, I streamed the first three hours of this game last night as part of a little midnight launch stream. And then things off arriving at this town right here. Let me show you where it is on the map. On the map. On the map. Give me your launch money. I mean, uh, yeah, right here. So yeah. Start away from here and made it all the way up here. I can be here, I can be there anywhere, but I'm over here. Can't you see? Don't you know? But yeah. In case anybody's curious, um, here's uh, my team right now for those who missed the midnight launch stream. Allow me to show you who's who. Here we got my starter, Max. My freelance little buddy. Polly Pret's tail. Uh, Toby Fox. Unmet. Rigby. And last but not least, Crunk. Oh yeah, the team's all coming together. But yeah, this is my team right now. Love them all. Thank you. They're all good boys. So yeah. Anyways, as I just mentioned, uh, I had things off last night. I'm arriving at this town right now, so let's see what awaits us next on a big journey in the world of Gala. Not the Green Galvin Gal, the world of Galar. Wordplay. So burly young trainer who's brave the wild area. Do you remember what your goal in Motostock is? Um, I forget, Sonia. Or Frankie. You forget? What do you mean you forget, Mr. Stupid Piece of Poo Poo? What? You seriously forgot about the gem challenge opening ceremony? Oh, hey, Dinner Warrior and Yami, welcome. Hey, Bisonos! It's the Super Duper Sumo Stream Show! Oh, get it? Super Duper! Oh, get it? <laughs> Is that a skunk colored zigzagoon? Yeah! Rigby's a rock star now. Mommy, look at me! Mommy, I'm a rock star! By the way, the thermal tomorrow is being held at the Motostock Stadium, okay? But I just woke up. It's me held tomorrow. So get some extra sleep. Go home and get some extra sleep. Use that left door there to get to the stadium, okay? Okay. Oh, later. I'm gonna swing by the shops while I'm here. But don't forget to register at the stadium, okay? Okay, he's my favorite letter of the alphabet. Okay, now I could head to the stadium, but, um... I did a little few off-stream things before I'm um, starting tonight. Uh, as y'all may know, I checked out some of the wild area last night, but uh, guess what? There are two areas that we actually haven't explored yet. I'm not sure how we can access this yet. X use I. An I for an I. Yeah, we have yet to visit these two places yet, so um, I'm going to go over here, do some extra level grinding, maybe capture some more Pokemon. And then we'll check out the stadium. Hopefully this is where the Fry Cook games are being held at. So yeah. Let's see what we can find today in the wild area. Okay, now I think I want to go this way if I want to make it over there. Hmm. Oh yeah, I didn't carry you last night. <laughs> Those things chased me. What are physics, anyway? It's not even flapping its wings! Yep, there they go chasing me again! <laughs> Leave me alone! Rolling fields. Okay, is this where I want to be? 
Let me check my map. I'm starting to become Leon at this point. Yep, I'm lost. <laughs> I'm lost! Okay, okay, came from that way, then... What? Why are you glowing? Why are you glowing? Okay, this happened with a Pokemon I wasn't able to encounter last night, but I want to see what this is all about. Is it stronger? Is it special IVs or some shit? It's gliding. It's gliding with style. We well, already caught one of these things uh, last night, so I'm just gonna try to fight it. So I'm. Wow, that hit very hard. Copycat. Again! Crud. I'm sorry, Max. Okay, we haven't actually used Rigby yet. Uh, let's set him out. Let's give him the good luck. Come on. Damn it! Okay, come on, hit it. Okay, good. Good boy. Good job, Raybone. Think good. We can get water battles too. That's new. Rigby is fighting Mordecai. Maybe one of his cousins, but uh, I think the closest thing we're gonna get to Mordecai is uh. Hold on, let me open up my Pokedex. Current recommendations, Delibird. Yeah, a Pokemon that nearly whooped my ass last night. Good suggestion. An excellent suggestion. Up uh, this right here. This looks like Mordecai. Mordecai and Rigby made it into this game. It's not just Rigby. Looks like Rigby's bragging rights have come to an end. Oh wait, you know I gotta go this way. Gotta get to get, gotta get to get, gotta get to get, gotta get to get to a new area in this place. Yeah, I want to go back over there and then take the lower route. That's what I need to do. Delay Bird's one of your favorites, you know me? That's interesting. <laughs> Surprised to see someone that actually really loves a Pokemon. I like Delay Bird too, but he's not one of my favorites. Oh my god, it's so bright. Hey, Volpix wasn't here last night. Alright, we can catch one of these. A strong looking one. Oh boy. Time to run away. This thing has solar beam, I swear to god. Okay, never mind then. <laughs> Thank God for Polly's ability. Do 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 exploring the Lord area. The Lord D Wild area. You scare me. <laughs> that thing's freaking huge. Look at that thing. You can probably grab him with his big claws and stuff. Okay, yeah, this I haven't pl visited yet. Hmm. 
Hmm. What do I want to get here? I take the high road, you take the low road. What's that, Pokeball? Give me that. A serving of leftovers. Nice. You already caught some Snover last night, or at least one of them. Who well, I need to rename, by the way. <laughs> I called it a Miss Sir. A Miss Star. When it's supposed to be a missus. Hmm. Let's go for that mud, bro. Like, I want to get that. We can start a Christmas tree biz business here. Christmas trees everywhere. Hm. I thought that was a shiny for a second. Never mind. <laughs> oh, snow run. Okay, we can catch this. Very strong looking snow run. Oh boy. <laughs> Is there anything that's not strong looking? Please. Check your whispers for an offer on your channel. Okay, I'll look at that later. I'll check my whispers for a special TV offer. Whoa. Physics. What are physics? Incredible. Time to get the impression that all these Pokemon might be strong. So far, Dober's strong. Oh, get it? Oh, y'all Pokeball. What's that about? What's this one all about? All those. Cool. Check it out. A brand new Pokemon. I'm crazy strong and flush with cash. Why won't anyone battle me? How about you? Dare take me on? Okay. I will take you out. All right. Snap to it. Let a battle begin. Look at that textured nose. Okay, I expected that Pokemon to be a way higher level. Thank God that's not... Like how them on. Okay, but it hits pretty hard. That Steelix isn't flying. He's just so ugly that the ground repels him upward of disgust. <laughs> that explains it. It's Wario's long lost sister. Holy crap! The Mario lore has expanded. We'll quick attack it for now. So I'm It's okay, Polly. You did good out there. You won't get the cannon punishment. Don't worry. If only I can look at the stats of my Pokemon. Okay, we'll use Met for right now. Oh, yeah, yeah. We can't check the summary. We just gotta select it. <laughs> I'm stupid. Okay, I'm gonna bring Max back from the dead. No, I do not want to capture that trainer's Pokemon. <gasps> or can we? I always wanted a Grookey on my team. But yeah, we got to win this battle. I bet that Grookey's a shadow Pokemon. We have to purify it.
Do I have any potions? No, I do not. And no, the berries will help either. I'll just say mix out and see what happens. We ain't afraid of no monkeys. It's fire burrito time. Burn! Yeah. Sobble. Does she have all three starters? Yeah, we'll go for Toby. Yeah, it says stream in the top right corner, looking at OBS. Starting to think I might be right. Also got a burp again. <clears throat> Excuse me. Remember the drink you Dr. Pepper, kids? They put a Corgi in Pokemon? Yep. It's the annoying dog from Undertaker. He accepted me, so I add him to my team. Nuzzle time. Again! You did good, Toby. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's night time. That's what you get for spewing on my doggo. Yeah, she has score bunny. Called it. I'm a psychic. Okay, time to crunk it up. My fellow crunkers, where you at? Because it's crunk time. Okay, we'll eat them. I'll eat you all alive. I was afraid of that. What's up, T Cheeks do? If he needs to tell Barry, it'll raise its defense. Well, don't have a Barry, so. Yeah. We'll use Bite again. Okay, if you're gonna lower my attack, I'll just lower your defense by doing this. It's ass shaking time, crunk. You know what to do. Appropriate move. Mm. Mm. 
I'll just leave Crunk out and see what happens. Okay, looks like I'm in the yellow. That's good enough. Looks like that score bunny is hot on our tail. Yep. <laughs> I'd say he's hot on our tail. We're gonna fight score bunny with score bunnies. Who's that hot looking rabbit? Max, stop flirting with the enemy and take him down. So I'm Good job, Max. Did good. We beat Wario's sister. You must be pretty amazing to be me. You're a regular wild air expert. You're crazy strong too. I'll teach you a good trick then. There are heaps of items lying around the wild air that people have dropped. Go around picking them up and then selling them off. You can be flush with cash too. I'll work on getting even stronger yet, so come find me for another battle sometime. New rival unlocked. Up. Oh. Yeah, that's snow run. But we can't catch it. <laughs> I kinda wanna take this thing on tonight. Like the max ray battle thing, but uh let me go to another area, because I'm afraid it's this thing might be ridiculously strong in this area, given that most of these things are very strong. <laughs> They're just too strong. Can't they just let me catch them? What do you do? Alright, what do you got for me? Pushing piece. For the one in to attract the Diamax Pokemon. Don't have enough money. I need more of them dough. Ooh, Krabby! Oh, right. <laughs> no, I'll try to catch this thing anyway. Everpire is still alive. It's Mama Crabs in her younger years. Check it out. Could this mean that we traveled back in time before the events of the Nuzlocke? Something about the visuals or graphics of this game reminds me of Dragon Quest VIII. Yeah, the graphics in this game look really good. Definitely one of the best looking Pokemon games today. Well met. Show them that you're the bigger nut. Okay, let's just use Absorb. I need protection. Okay, now to catch it. But first, uh, let's revive Max, because I kind of want to level him up to level 16 before taking on the stadium. Alright. Oh, I need to get more Pokeballs, but do your thing! Okay. <laughs> Time to rewrite history, I guess, because we're going to kill this thing instead now. Is 
Stop throwing shit at my nut, please. It's nasty. Okay, hopefully tackle this job. Sublub! We killed Mama Krabs in the past! Hooray for murder! Oh shit, he's evolving! First evolution! He's a kung fu nut now. Kung fu nutting! So let's see what Dr. Singer has to say about him now. Nuzleaf. It lives deep in forests. With the leaf on its head, it makes a flute whose song makes you listeners uneasy. Play the Super Duper Sumo's theme song, Matt. I know you can do it. Hmm. Mm. We'll get rid of Astonish. I've rarely been using that move at all. Nup man. He has nips. Wow. Can we game freaking clue that? Okay, we're heading back to the town because I need to heal up and get more Pokeballs. So time for more backtracking, backtracking, back a lick a lick a lick a tracking. Yeah, I need to go from this way, it looks like. Anyway, um, how are y'all doing today, guys? What's your story on this beautiful day? So much for No Nut November. Yup. <laughs> I failed it. Bowser failed it. And now Met failed it because he evolved. Doing good? That's good, you okay, lover. Going up the stairs and going up the stairs. Okay. Back to the hospital! Doing good, about to do the gym, but gonna save that until you start as well. Oh, cool! Let's see, you're trying to catch up with me, Duke. <laughs> yeah, I expected Max to evolve first, not Matt. Weird. Okay, you're new. Indeed. Uh, what do you do? Got some Pokemon questions? Feel free to ask away. Oh, you're the name raider. Okay. So I can just change our names here whenever then. In that case, let's fix Mr. Snow. I mean, Miss Snow's name. It's quite a fine name. But it's a girl, though. It's quite a fine name. But whatever, you're changing it, I don't fucking care. So let's get on with it anyway. Okay, since we found the name raider, um, there's something I do want to do before heading back out there. Okay, um, for those who don't know, um, there is a mystery gift going on right now, or a mystery gift event. They can get a super special Dynamax Meowth. And I kind of want to bring it along with us, so, uh... Let me save first. Oh. Let me save first. If I the white button was the save button, but... <laughs> Zoom didn't screen my monitor. Yeah, I'm gonna try to get this me out for Mystery Gift, and... I'm hoping it's a dude, because... Like a bunch of other Pokemon that I caught beforehand, uh... I already know what to call it. 
So let's see what happens. We're connected to the internet. Yeah, there it is. Okay, let's see what Dr. Stinger has to say about Meowth. That's right! It loves to collect shiny things. If it's in a good mood, it might even let its trainer have a look at its hoard of treasures. Why does we hide the treasure, Meowth? Why does we hide the treasure? Why does we hide the treasure? James, tell Jesse why we be hiding treasure. I don't feel like it's Meowth. I'm just gonna look at it. And make it part of my ball cap collection. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Guess that might be your answer. Okay, let's see. Let's have a little look, see. Okay, is me alpha boy? <gasps> yes, okay, good, good. Y'all ready for this? The epic comeback of a lifetime. Yes. Bling Bling Boy is back, motherfuckers! And this time, he's going to get Susan Test! That's right. Frankie Foster is actually Susan Test! You have been fooled to this whole time! I might bring him, like, maybe later or next time I go live because he's extremely underleveled right now and I maybe might level grind him off stream. Okay, let me look at my Pokemon real quickly. Okay, we're going back out there to level grind some more and catch some Pokemon, hopefully. Because, yeah. I'm gonna get max to level 16 and then we'll take on the stadium. Want to be prepared. What is about what's over here? Check it out! A brand new Pokemon! Unless it's Yzma again. Yeah, but you're Yzma. Yeah, what brilliant thing do you have for me this time? Thank you. Still would like a potion to turn... Cusco and Crunk back into humans. Whipping noises intensifies. Yeah, there better be a shit ton of whip cracks when he dynamaxes. One of my old favorites. Before a Cypher, Sudowoodo, and the Munchlax line. We can try to capture this one. I like Godish. As I just mentioned. Here. I'm bling bling. I'm bling bling. You can tell because it says I'm a ring ring. The most out oh, ain't no pass. Gonna keep rubbing hard till I get Susan Test. And I forgot to get more Pokeballs because I'm a fucking Thoris. Yeah. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Well, <laughs> time for more backtracking, I guess. Uh, yeah, how about a good move? We'll get rid of Lear. Yeah, Bling Bling Blue was definitely one of the best things about Johnny Test. We can all agree on that. Backtracking, backtracking, back a lack a lack a ding dong tracking. I'm not sure I have enough money to get more Pokeballs. I mean, if not, I can at least sell some of the stuff that I got in this area. I gotta sell, 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 sell. 
We sell. Sell. That thing's green. <laughs> green. Okay, let's sell some... Poils. Given to me by Yzma. Hopefully they don't turn these salespeople into Pokemon. Okay, give me your entire stock of Pokebales. Or... We'll do 34, because that's the amount of... Audio filter I have on uh, OBS right now. And we'll just buy the potions for the rest of my money. Okay, have a nice day! Thank you, come again. Okay, back out here again. Bling bling only sells for gold, not silver. Pokemon bling bling boy heart gold edition. Can't wait to see that get released in the next 100 years. Okay, there's an Oddish. Did I ever tell you guys the story of this uh, shiny Oddish that I found in the Safari Zone? It was my first ever encounter with shiny Pokemon, as a matter of fact. Yeah, I was like exploring the Safari Zone for like new Pokemon to capture and Right the hell out of nowhere, I found a shiny Oddish, and... This is right before I even found out that shiny Pokemon were even a thing, and I was like... Oh my god. Like, I thought the game was glitched. <laughs> so, um... I think I tried to catch it, but it ran away, but... Yeah. <laughs> First time discovering it. it. Was interesting. Yeah, let's use a regular Pokeball. Pokeball, do your thing! Gotcha! Yahey! There's our level 16. Okay, let's see what dots are... Um... Actually, no. Not yet. It's not time yet, Luigi! I'm gonna wait till I get to the stadium. From there, maybe we can level them up there, or evolve them. <laughs> yeah, let's see what Dr. Singer has to say about Oddish. Um, if exposed to moonlight, it starts to move. It roams far and wide at night to scatter its seeds. Alright, guys. First Pokemon of the night that y'all get to nickname. Male Oddish. What are we gonna name him? Oddball. Maybe. Give it 20 more seconds and then I'll confirm it as his name. I'm a patient boy. I'm patient. I'm patient. Can't you see? Cause I'm lation. I'm making up rhymes. Add lemon. Nothing? Okay, I'll ball it is. I'll buy the little twerp and oddball. Okay, since we have max level 16 now, it's time to take on the stadium. And hopefully be part of the Fry Cook Games. Going up the stairs again. Uh oh. Yeah, I think maybe after I do the stadium, I'll do some max ray battles or at least try to do one. I'm offline, I mean. Still like to do a group one sometime. Hey, 
Hey, Leon. Lost again? I'd surely never make it to the stadium without you to show me the way, partner. Even with a huge old thing like this bang in the middle of the city, I still get lost. Mars. You alright? Yo, Mars. You alright? One look tells me that you become a trainer worthy of the endorsement that I gave you. And yes, I reckon you might even be ready to use this. Here, try giving this to your partner to hold. Oh boy, charcoal. Is this your Christmas gift to me? I feel so insulted! You can take that lift up to the city's upper level if you're headed for the stadium next. I can't believe Leon was Santa this whole time. <gasps> I've been a good boy this year! I swear, I swear! Check it out, I'm dancing. I like dancing! Yeah. Okay, anyways, let's go up the left. Going up. What in God's green earth is that thing? I want to interact with that thing. How dare you interrupt me, Hop? You made it too? Also, I had to fight physics and force you to come over here because I have cocked something ghost powers if you haven't caught on by now. Monostoke Stadium. This is where the opening ceremony will be held. Everyone will be watching the opening ceremony for the gym challenge. For the Bubble Bass Challenge. My mom, your mom, the whole world's moms will be coming here. It's getting me a bit nervous, really. And a bit turned on. But anyway, no, nah, this isn't nerves. I'm only trembling because I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Super duper excited. Get it? Come on, Mons. It's time the world learned our names. Okay, but first, let me talk to this thing that you interrupted me interacting with, Hop. Ta-da! You took the time to talk to a Pokeball, so you deserve a little reward. Thanks! In case you were wondering, I'm not just any old Pokeball, because I am an old Pokeball! But who am I, you ask? Well, the answer is simple. They call me the Ball Guy. Wow. They should hire him for the next season of Ball Fondlers. He'll be a fan favorite character, I guarantee it. Would you take a look at this? This place is packed with gym challengers. Every one of these folks is another rival. Check it out! A brand new rival! Let's get signed up. Sign me up. I'm telling you for the last time, this isn't a fast food joint. Damn it. I just want to go to McDonald's. Get that Szechuan sauce. Seriously? What a piece of work. In more ways than one. Hop. We're in a public place. D d don't do that. Please! Nasty. Also making sure my mic's, uh, went over my chin. Okay, good. <laughs> if you're here to register for the gym challenge, or bubble bass challenge, I'll need to see your endorsement, please. Sure, here's my sponsorship from Hulk Hogan. Please buy an ultimate grill. The lineup is dying! Fancy that. Fancy that. That's the porno mags that me and Haley read! Oh my god! This is the first time we ever had a challenger endorsed by the champion and Hulk Hogan. Well, now- Oh, whoops, wrong voice. <laughs> well, now you had to, because I am as well. What? Two of you at once? I wonder what's come over Leon this year. The two must be something special. Hell yeah, I'm a cocksucking ghost. You better believe it. Anyway, I'm Hawk. I'm Leon's little brother, in fact. And the next champion. Get me all signed up, would ya? Well, uh, yes, I'm trying to. If you'll just give me a moment. Hop, sponsored by IHOP. <laughs> it's IHOB. Remember when they changed that name? 
There. You two have been successfully registered as gym calendars. Also burping time again. <clears throat> it's just like barely been drinking this Dr. Pepper. It's like... Still a fifth gone. It's in a cup, by the way. Now you can choose your preferred number for uniform, if you'd be so kind. It'll be slayed on the back of the uniform. You must wear for any official match. Oh, I wanted to do 8,008. Oh, well. We'll just use my old um, username. 318. Lunch likes 318. Still likes 318. To my old YouTube names before I got terminated twice. Number 318, is it? Very well. And here, please order this challenge band at all times to identify yourself as a gym challenger. The opening ceremony for the gym challenge, or bubble bass challenge, is to be held here tomorrow. All trainers taking part have been booked a room at the nearby Badoo drop in. That's a champion chairman for you. Even booked us all hotel robes. I'm off to check out the fancy digs. Might as well go after him. What's your story? You're looking a bit gobsmacked by all this. You must be from some small country town, is that it? I'm quite the same myself. Okay! Hey. What's up? I was endorsed by the chairman himself. In other words, among all those elite enough to get an endorsement, I'm the most elite of them all. But I'm also disappointed that this isn't a fucking McDonald's. I was totally going to order McDonald's from here, but I'm that disappointed. So why don't you clear off and not try talking to me again, would you? Or I'm going to cancel you. It's positively criminal of you wasting the time of someone as poor as I am. Mean. But alright. You must be Challenger Moz. The Badoo drop-in is down this way. If you'd be so kind of uh, follow me. Follow me! We're also planning to attack the grocery store! I'm pretty sure Max would like that. His bloodlust is growing stronger day by day, let me tell ya. Challenger Maz, we have arrived at the Badoo drop-in. Try to get some rest and build your strength for what's to come. Okay. Into one of the seven Koopa hotels I go! Well, if it isn't Susan Test. Yeah, that's right. I figured out your real identity. Well, you got me. Yeah, I'm fucking through and test, what about, but... Looks like you both got yourselves registered. Oh, hey, Susan. What are you doing at our hotel? What are you doing here at one of the seven Koopa hotels? Imaginary Susan test? I'm researching the mysterious Pokemon. Our bug monster that's said to be in the slumbering wheel or forbidden forest. If I reckon I can look into some of Gal's legends, I might figure something out. Can you join me? You're already here anyway. Moz, you can get new clothes and a haircut in this town. Really? Okay, I'll check that out after this then. What's this then? It's a statue of the hero who once saved the Gala region. I can run for the legend right quick if you fancy. The short version if you please. Speedrun tactics. Long ago, a great black storm covered the Gala region. People called it the darkest day. The land was assaulted by gigantic Pokemon, but they were defeated by a single young hero bearing a sword and shield. The statue is here that meant to depict the young hero of the legend. Ha! Ah, I suppose that hero must have been as strong as Lee then. Looks like you're gonna have to have your hands full of plenty of research though, Sonia. I mean, Susan. Like storms and swords and shields and all. You'll be alright. You're alright! Ha, oh, thanks! I'm out of fruit somehow, don't you worry. You tour thing here at the Koopa Hotel tonight though, aren't you? So you check in? Probably so. And look out for you too, Susan. 
If we hear anything about any hero or not, we'll tell you. Good thing Bling Bling's on my party right now, or he'd be going freaking ape shit. <laughs> I'll tell you that right now. Please let me check into the Koopa Hotel. Can I go in here? Okay, I'm surprised that's not a fake door. Let's go back down. Too bad it's not playing the Hotel Mario music. We came all this way to the big city so that we can probably challenge gym challenges. Team you here the hell back, though. If you're in for battle, if you want to stop us. Sorry to bother you. But I gotta take you out. I got to take you out! Didn't we tell you, mate? You get in our way and you're in for a battle. Team L's about helping, helping one very special trade with the Jin the Double Bears challenge, that is. We want to make sure she gets chewed on and nice and proper. And now you're going to help us make some noise. Okay, evil team time, it looks like. This isn't the beautiful Kuba Hotel, but... Whatever. Lies in whatever. Let's bounty kick him. Bounty kick. There. We're looking for a fight, and I lost. I lost? I can't believe I lost! <laughs> it's the end! <laughs> the end! Oh! <laughs> hey, this is pretty good! If only Boomer were here. I'm so pathetic. I'm helping a friend figure out a name for Sable, and I think I got the perfect fit. Really? Uh, what is it, Dinner Warrior? Would you like to tell us? Oh, give me a break here. Team Yell, get revenge for me, would you? Revenge! Cross the guy you cover, mate. Or it could be better than a battle in a lovely hotel lobby. In a lovely Koopa hotel lobby. Oh, certainly that poster isn't a dead giveaway of who they are working for. I bet they're working for the ball guy from earlier. That ball guy looks really suspicious. I'm gonna be surprised if he's the main antagonist for this game. I must have been, ca been, been carried away being this swanky hotel doll. Sorry for getting your way. No, oh, man. The swanky sophisticated in here has caught me off my game. I could keep my cool. I wasn't expecting checking in would be such a big fuss, Mars. What's going on? Stay in some Pokemon battles without me? Don't even get ahead of me that easily. I need some training, so I'm joining. In more ways than one. Stop. Or I'm gonna kick you out of the hotel. But whatever. Not to make up for my stupid mistake in sexual overtones, I'll heal up your Pokemon. I'm Hop. A cock-sucking poltergeist. And one of this year's gym challengers. And I'm the one who's gonna be champion next. Let us have a nice two-on-two. We're gonna double team Supreme! I can only hear my victory coming. The only sign you'll make is a wimp of the free. Take him out, boys! Yeah, I think Nicky might be the bigger threat. 
Gender bit Nikolai. How dare you kick me? I'm highly offended. Alien Dunan, it's a Sebrick Scottish song about a weeping woman mourning her love that was lost to the sea. We have sad water in Britain. Perfect. That is a good nickname, Dinner Warrior. I like it. I'm not sure you're going to be able to fit in the full name, but... Maybe the first part. It good. Okay, now we just gotta take out Rigby's clone, it looks like. We're gonna double kick Supreme! Found a kick! Yeah. My voice is unsure when I'm sad. I want to yell, but I'm unsure. When I came to see the gym, gym bubble bass challenge opening ceremony, but this is awful. Oh my goodness, this is awful. Guess it was the feet I heard coming. I think I'm about to cry. Like a teensy weensy baby. What are you lot doing here? Money? Uh, nothing. It was just... I know you're all terribly curious about the Uber Gym Challengers, but you gotta show a bit of restraint. Sorry about them. They're just a bunch of my fans. They call themselves Team Yell and follow me around. Cheer for me. I think they all let it go to our heads a bit. Come on, you lot. Back home with you now. They're just so caught with wanting to support me, and all they tend to do is get a bit shirty with other gym challengers. Sure, they cause you any trouble. So you're a gym challenger too? Team Yell, was it? Pretty impressive that you already have a set of fans to call your own. Okay, let's check into the Koopa Hotel! Good evening, and welcome to one of the seven Koopa Hotels. You must be one of the Pokemon trainers that are wearing the Bubble Bass Challenge, right? Fuck you! Yes, young Mr. Moz. I see that the lake has blocked a room for you. And if I might, thank you for helping us out of a sticky situation with those hooligans earlier. I hope you have a pleasant stay here with us. Sleep well. Be your guest, be your guest. Please rest in the room and rest. And try this shit, it's delicious! THE NEXT MORNING! Morning. So this is it. Now my legend really begins. When's the adventure really going to start? These people keep saying this stuff. I'm so confused! Is this entire game just one big prologue? Watch out, Buzz. I'll beat you to Mostock Stadium. Hop only takes the gold, not silver. Gym Challenger, the opening ceremony is starting soon. Please allow me to escort you to the gym stadium. Yoki. All right, fall close and be careful not to lose sight of me. We made it to the stadium entrance. Please hurry to the opening ceremony. Well, Seymour, I made it. Despite being a bit late. Oh, Challenger Moz, welcome! I hope you're prepared for unforgettable battling. You must ask if the gym challengers wear their uniforms for all official events. The opening ceremony marks the beginning of the gym challenge, so you know what that means. That's right. I need to get changed as well. I'm a Koopa football player now, look at me. Wonderful! 
You look as sharp as a pin. In that 318 there. The number really is the number for you. Now we're ready at last for the opening ceremony for this year's Bubble Bears Challenge. Get off the stage! I have such adoring fans! Yes, sirree! Ladies and gentlemen! Welcome to the 22nd Annual Shit Eating Cum Games! I'm a realistic dickhead, and I know that everyone gathered here and everyone watching from home have been waiting for this big moment. It is my pleasure to announce that finally, the Gallery Region Bubble Best Challenge will begin. Yes! The Gym Bubble Bass Challenge. Participants must beat the eight gym leaders and gather the eight gym badges to prove their skills as a trainer. Only the most worried will have the honor of challenging the greatest champion in history, Bubble Bass. Or, I mean, Leon, right. But anyway, I'd like to invite the gym leaders to show themselves. Show yourself. The Fighting Farmer! Here's the Grass Type Expert, Milo Murphy! The Raging Wave! It's the Master of Water Types, Nessa! The Ever Burning Man of Fire! Here comes the Fire Type Veteran, Kabu! Get off the stage! The God Karate Prodigy! Nobody's better with Fighting Tops than B! The Master of Fantastic Theater! It's the Charming Fairy Type User, Opal! The Hard Rock Crusher! Please welcome to the Rock Monster, Gordy. Yeah, he's a monster. But last but not least, the Tamer Dragons. It's Raihan, the top gym leader. Unfortunately, we're missing one, but... These are the gym leaders that in the Galar region that we are proud to call our own. Time to play soccer with the Koopalings. I mean, football. Football. It's always been football. Now, where's that egg Luigi turned into? Standing there on the pitch in the stadium in front of everyone. There's really no words for it, but I can barely contain myself. My heart's racing. The pipes are up. I'm hornier than a two-tone slock off. I You made it last, Hump. And you too, Boz. So you two are the trainers. Our champion endorsed himself. And Hulk Hogan. Amazing. Welcome, and it's a delight to meet you. I am the realistic dickhead. The fucking piece of shit. And gay man. Realistic dickhead, yeah. And what's this? I see you both already possess Dynamax bands. How wonderful! It seems you two have been led here by the guiding light of the wishing stars. By the way, it was my wonderful company that invented those Dynamax bands, you know. I dare say this year's gym challenge is looking to be an absolute blast. Very good. Very good indeed. That means the whole Gala region is in for some excitement. Super exciting! The Gym Challenge is an excellent opportunity to show off your Dynamax Pokémon. Now, I'm terribly sorry, but there is some urgent business I need to attend to, so I must be on my way. Best of luck to both of you! I need to have my face surgically remade into a swordfish. Or tuna thing. Whatever. Whatever. The chairman certainly seems to be in high spirits. Now listen closely, you two. You both only just started on your path as trainers. If you want to win, you need to do more than just train your Pokemon. You need to train yourselves, too. Let's do it, Mons. You know the gym challenge, or Bulbass challenge, has a set order that you gotta visit the gyms in, right? The first is in Turfield. 
And to get there, we need to head to Route 3. Okay, the Bubble Bass is an event which aspiring trainers travel around the Gal region to try to collect gym badges from eight of its gyms. To earn a gym badge, you have to complete that gym's mission and also defeat its gym leader. Interesting. So it looks like gym battles are back. Cool. Challenger Mars, the chairman asked me to deliver this gift for you. Trophy delivery! A gift. Such a wonderful thing. From the chairman. Such a wonderful man. <laughs> Excuse me, uh, the gift is access to the flying taxis. Allow me to end in a word. Fly! Calling a flying taxi will allow you to travel quickly back to the areas you already visited. Cool, so it's basically fast travel. If it's alright with you, I'll read a segment from the Flying Taxi's user manual. Ahem. Press the X button and select the town map and choose the place you want to go. Blah, 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 blah. You should already know how this works. But anyway, your next goal should be Turfield. Isn't that right, Moz? I'm challenging to a new place. It's best to get there on your own two legs, don't you think? I best I better get going. Thank you for all your support, people. I'll do my best. Do my best, do my best, do it every day. Well, hello. Okay, that might come in handy. Maybe. It could come in handy, you never know. Let's heal up really quickly. Okay, have a nice day! Let's go back outside and sing, but we're not gonna do that. Because it's time for another cutscene. There you are. I've been waiting. Let's have a battle. You and me. We'll even get a bit of training. But why? Wanna head to a new route? Seriously? This is the moment when you play along and act pumped for that battle. I don't feel like it. Too bad. Too bad. Yeah, too bad. If you want to ask why we should be bummer training, you'll never make it for the gym challenge. Okay, guess I gotta battle him then. Damn you, story progression. Time for another series of penetration. Keep up, mate. This is our chance to see if we are up for the Bubble Bass Challenge. Okay, Hop. I'll do what you say, since the game is forcing me to. Doesn't mean I can take advantage of you? No! Damn it. Typical. Should I know you mastered type matchups? No, we'll leave Max out. Let's go, Mojo Jojo. I'll take you down. Fabritos. Have a taste of our true power. Our green power just keeps on growing stronger. Lucky tree branches are no match for Max. Scratch! Please don't scratch my face. Bird! Yeah. Flame charge. Hmm. Yeah, we'll get rid of Tackle. Ok, 
Okay, it's time to battle Mordecai again, so... Let's do this! Mordecai versus Rigby. Back into a corner. You got all wrong, mate. This will just make my victory all the better. The battle of the century. What's up about him? I'm gonna prove that I'm player one, Mordecai. We ain't afraid of no Blue Jays. So let's tackle him. So I'm Rigby Woods. I beat you! Yeah! Now I can be player one! Was that really good trading? Looks like I better keep my guard up. Gotta move that guard up! Actually, not yet. <laughs> it's still not time, you Luigi! I just remembered something that I actually uh, want to try out. More on that later, but first we gotta get through this cutscene. Just what I expect from my rival. You know what? I'll even give you one of my league cards. I'll give you one of my Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Oh boy! That's how good I think you did in that battle. Thanks! Our gym challenge starts right now. From here into Moto Stoke. Oh hey Hector, welcome to the stream. How you doing buddy? Although the first gym leader will have to challenge is in a town far away from here. So you better believe I'm going to keep on winning my way to that championship match. Hello, Geller. Me, your next champion. From the sleepy town of Pittsburgh, it's me, Hop, the cock sucking poltergeist. I'm taking everything from you. Give me your virginity. Okay, as for um, what that thing I actually want to try out is, uh, apparently you can cook curry in this game, and I just figured out off stream on how to do it, so let's try it out. Oh, no, not this. Not this. Not these. Cooking. Okay, cooking at camp. Cook up a fine curry while camping by selecting ingredients and berries are you liking. Your curries will get more delicious if you choose to do things like using rare ingredients or adding lots of berries too. Once you start cooking, fan the flames and stir and stuff. I'll be to cooking class. After you finish eating, it'll be time for everyone to dig in together. Eating a tasty curry can have effects on Pokemon at your camp. Including restoring their HP and making them feel friendly. Let's start cooking. Max. We have to cook. How much do you want to bet that Max is going to poison our food? Because I can definitely see him doing that. What are the names of my Pokemon? I'm going to show that off after we do this. Let's try a Peckaberry. And a Cherryberry. And this. Okay, this too. Leaves all the berries. Oh. What a mansion, Tam. So I would have liked to use Hulk Hogan's Ultimate Grill, but this works too. Stirring the chili. We're Chef Peepee -Pee now. We have to cook for our Pokemon. If we have Bowser in our party, this would be a lot more accurate. Holy shit, was that a Song Forces reference? Oh my god!
Dry Burger Steak Curry. A Junior Western Bacon Steak Curry. Eat the curry, Moz. I made it myself. Well, you actually didn't poison it. I'm surprised, Max. Cool. Alright, that was kind of neat. Okay, I'm anyway, I'm Hector. For the Pokemon that I got, uh... This is Max. This is Rigby. This is Met. This is Polly Pretztail. This is to Toby Fox. <laughs> Tommy Toby Fox. And right there is Krunk. Because the Krunk them deserves to live on. If you know what I mean. <laughs> right. But yeah. That's my team right now. Also, we just evolved a Met earlier. First member, too. And Max is on the verge of evolving, too, but I wanted to <laughs> cook with him first, but. Yeah, we got to try it out, so... Back to adventure. Let's get going! Also new route. Let's see what we can find here. It's that flower thing, but I kinda want it. Okay, battle time looks like. You saw the opening ceremony, right? Then you know why I'm excited one of the battle. Man overboard? No! Let's do a double kick. Man, a kick! Okay, hopefully quick attack does a job. Sublum! Yeah. I lost! I lost! I lost? I can't believe I lost! I'm still excited. <laughs> so I'm not gonna cry about like Mamu. Want that Pokeball. Want that Pokeball! It's Rigby's family. Check it out. Dead. No big surprise. Also, welcome, nations. How you doing, my friend? I've been studying foreign languages, computers, and Pokemon. Do you know zombie language? What's that? Well, allow me to educate you. With a battle! <laughs> Feed him the rig juice. I don't have it on me though. Maybe I can cook it, but I gotta find more ingredients. Or I can just have um, Rigby piss into um, the pot. We can make some extra special rig juice curry. What the? Coward. Okay, Krunk. Take him out. Tasty! Hi, pandas. It's my long time companda. Ow! Okay, now you're back in, looks like. What if you cooked Rigby the Mississippi Queen? Maybe we can try that out, actually. I called the Mississippi shit! It's made with cum lubrication, a bag of crack, and all sorts of shit. What? I lost? I lost? I can't believe I lost! My Pokemon wasn't savvy enough. 
wonder if all these trainers are related to Mamu, considering they keep gloating about how much they lost. Oh, Trubbish! Trubbish, come back! Come back! I love you! I really like Trubbish. Trubbish is a really underrated Pokemon. Wait, there's one right there. I'm coming for you! Oh my god, those textures look really good on that thing. They look a lot more detailed compared to the 3DS games. Good graphics! Cherry berries make spicy curry. Noted. Trubbish, use acid! Oh no, now Max is gonna trip on shit. My face feels like magic. Okay, let's catch it. Pokeball, do your thing! Gotcha, yahey! Okay, let's see what Dr. Singer has to say about Trubbish. Its favorite places are unsanitary ones. If you leave trash lying around, you can even find one of these Pokemon living in your room. Are you saying that this trash can might be Trubbish? My life has been a lie! Oh my god! I just crushed a ball from this here trash can. This trash can?! <laughs> okay, but anyway, um, we got a female Trubbish. So what are we gonna name her? It's the trash woman. She likes to eat garbage. Your waifu. Nope. <clears throat> no. Trish. I guess. <laughs> kind of like Trish. It'll work. Eh, that'll do. Up to the Mugs Box. The Mugs Books. Yeah. Oh, look, it's Susan Test. Hiya, Jump Challenger. You look really nice out there during the opening ceremony. Oh, but where is up? I bet he went a different way. Well, you're rivals, after all. So I guess it makes sense that you train on your own. Oh, I know. Let me tell you about something a bit interesting. You see that building over there? It's a company owned by Captain Dickhead. A realistic dickhead, man. This past Route 3, there's a mine where they dig up ore. That building over there processes it into energy. In other words, the chairman is responsible for providing calories with its energy, too. It's five-hour energy. Can't say I really get him, but the chairman seems like a brilliant, brilliant guy, right? Here, a little something for having a chin wipe with me. It's an escape rope. Escape rope. Oh, he'll be a Pokemon too. Thanks. The way to turn off is pretty long, but that's a kind of challenge in its own right. Good luck, Jim Challenger. Good luck. Okay, onward. Hmm. What's this? What's here? Guess what they needed. What are these? Rolly Coley. It's Rolly Coley Oli. Yeah, let's see if we can catch one of these things. The move time. So long. Smoke. Smoking's bad for you. 
<laughs> oh, actually, I'm speaking of smoking. Uh, <laughs> a few weeks back, um, I had this assignment for audio production class where um, we had to make um PSAs, and uh, one of the ones I did was on smoking. Would you guys like to hear it? You shall like to listen to my PSA. Yeah. Okay then. Where there's smoke, there's fire. That's not what I meant, you barklehead. Okay, let me get this ready for you guys. Hold up. Just gotta find my folder. Um. Yeah, here it is. Okay. This here's a little PSA that lasts for 30 seconds revolving smoking. Get ready for a little Mozzie Says segment. Here we go. Hi, Wrinkly Kringle here to tell you about smoking. Smoking is bad for your health. About 4,800,000 people in the United States die from smoking each year. It can also sting your teeth, rupture your throat, and worst of all, it can make you sound just like me. Yeah. <laughs> so don't be a fool. Smoking is it cool? <laughs> yeah, I did that. Hope you liked it. Okay, we are back to the battle. Okay, hopefully, I'm we'll get into the yellow. Into the yellow, get mellow, get mellow, get yellow. Nice original character. Yep. He surely is the best character ever. Oh my god, Wrinkly Kringle's here. Um, what are you doing here, Wrinkly? I'm telling you to thank you for playing my advertisement that you helped me edit. Yep. Appreciate you doing voice work for me, um, Wrinkly Kringle. Sure thing. Hopefully I'll be on the next one. Bye. Okay, see you later. Yeah, he just jumped out my window. I'm not sure if you heard that in the background, but yeah. He's gone now. Let's try Premier Ball. Premier Ball, do your thing! We caught a rock. Yay! It's time, Luigi! Let's see what this Lagomorph rabbity thing turns into. Whoa. He's a freelance ninja now. Check it out. Looks like a Yoke Watch character the more I look at him. But anyway, let's see what Dr. Stinger has to say about him now. Its thick and fluffy fur protects it from the cold and enables it to use hotter moves. And now for Rory Coley's entry. Most of its body has the same composition as coal. Fittingly, this Pokemon was first discovered in coal mines about 400 years ago. Wow, this is a really old Pokemon. Holy crap. But anyway, <laughs> we got a male Rory Coley. What are we going to name him, guys? Rabotnik. I want to work for Robotnik, Mars. Too bad you're under ownership of me. Too bad. Yeah, too bad. Aw, oh, man, I hate that. Yeah. The Rock. The Rock or the Boulder. Don't touch shoulders, Boulder! We'll do The Rock. Roly poly oly. <laughs> Okay, I kind of like that better. Let's see if I can fit that in. Let's see if I can do it with spaces. <laughs> I 
<laughs> yeah, I can. Perfect fit. Or, no, I can't. <laughs> Gotta do it without spaces. There we go. And same thing too with the Mars box. A god, look at her. She's up to something. Gotta stay away from her. Don't mind me, I'm just standing like a statue. I'm gonna find a statue! Oh yeah! Look at me! Stab right there, pervert! I'll show you what I carry, letters of victory! Oh, postman. <laughs> if I were a cop, I'd do double jabs. Okay, Max. Time to defend the Leaf Village from this bird. I'm gonna be Hokage. I'm tired of being a policeman. Turns out I was carrying your victory. You'll never get it again. Okay, I'm gonna have the your police force arrest you for fraud. So uh, have fun in jail, you fuck nut. Uh, what's this about? If you want to heal up your Pokemon, there is nothing like setting up your camp and cooking them a good meal. Here, you can just bury to the pot. Just what I needed. One step closer to making the Mississippi Queen. If you ever come across a tent, check it out to join a camp of who set it up. If you like, you're welcome to visit my camp too. It's this one right here. Is it Camp Laszlo or Camp Kidney or Camp Coral? Love to give it a visit. He's got his hands in his pockets! Look at this smug ass rabbit right here. <laughs> I love Max. I really do. Let's see how everybody else is doing. Oh, wait, it's only Max on the field. Okay. Guess that makes sense. Max! Hey, Max! Let's talk to him. Seems to be worried about surroundings. I hate it here, Moz. Let's get a move on. No, you're gonna have fun. I have fun. Max seems tired and hungry. Okay, we can cook some food if you want. Let's get the cooking. We're going to make the Mississippi Queen. He might not have the lubrication come in a bag of crack, but... We can maybe make a Mississippi Queen substitute. And then we'll know. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I haven't got to see these controls yet. Extreme fanning! It's Wrestle Camp. Wrestle Camp! Wrestle Camp! Sumo Wrestler Camp! Stirring the Mississippi Queen. Stir, stir, stir. A nice Mississippi Queen for King Crybaby. Now! Mississippi Queen, we know what I mean. Oh, they look disappointed. Or do they? There's the Mississippi Queen. Well, it's a substitute. With some Hulk size burgers. Eat it, Maz.
delicious! Let's play fetch. Hey, Max! Catch! Get the ball, Max! Get on the ball! Shit on the ball! The big city detergent ball! Please? Get on the ball, Max! Please! Okay, fine. <laughs> We're done here. Let's get a move on. Okay, Parmy really wants to challenge the gym this stream, so... Let's do some speedrun tactics, if we can. I tell you to you, speedrun tactics if you can. Every Pokemon's got a type or two, and every type has strong points and weak ones. Really? I did not know that! I there, I just forgot just now. Thank you, Peter. Peter Parker. Or this guy's gonna be in Spider-Verse 2, and oh my god, what is that? What on God's green earth is that thing? Sizzlepeed. It's a flaming centipede. Cool. So long. Rap, rap. It's the rap, 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 rap. Gotta wrap these presents. I don't know where rhymes with presents, so yeah, rap, rap. <laughs> Freelance Jitsu! Yeah. Daughter. Okay, you're number new one. Look, then Tristan. I just burped without opening my mouth. <laughs> Not sure if you guys heard that, but I see that picked up in OPS. Anyway, um... Fire style jitsu! Yeah. We defeated Peter Parker! From this reality, at least. I'm weak to older people older than me. Okay, I want to go inside this cave. Wait, they mentioned that this is a mine, right? Maybe we can ride one of King Kenro's mine cops. Sorry, it looks familiar. What the? That just popped out of nowhere. I'm gonna follow it. We follow it. Hopefully, it'll take me to the King K. Ro Woobat. Still want Woobat. Working women are good at Pokemon battles, too. <laughs> it's Harry Molman. It's me, Harry Molman. Oh good, now I get to beat you up for what you did in episode 3 of season 1! But I changed them! That's what they always say. You don't need Roar. You don't need Roar. This mine is mine. The Smash Brothers Brawl is mine. It's mine. Oh, mine. Mine, oh, mine. Oh, mine, oh, mine. Oh, 
Okay, now this thing's part steel, so I expect it to be super effective. Oh, whatever, he's dead. And Drillbur's dead. Your Pokemon. I want to scout them. This isn't Pokemon Masters, worker. Wrong game. Oh, come on. Come here. Come here, Woobat, Woobat. Here, Woobat, Woobat, Woobat. Really want to get a female one. Come here. Okay, this one we can capture. Good. Female. Yes, okay. I want to capture this one. It's a Dorbat. We found her. Relance Jitsu! But Max, you don't even like girls! It's a phase, Maz. Or maybe it's not a phase. Okay, Pokeball, do your thing. Give me a door back, come on. Got her! Yay! Maybe doll eyes. <laughs> okay, for humor's sake, we'll teach her this move. <laughs> we don't need stockpile. Or this. Or this! But yeah, we finally got a doorbat. So let's see what Dr. Stinger has to say about her. The doorbat. When inside a cave, if you look up and see lots of heart-shaped markings lining the walls, it's evidence that a doorbat lives there. Also, she has a cave filled with bones. What's lore behind that? We don't fucking know, but... Yeah. <laughs> Allow me to do the honors. We got a hero of pure heart valley now. Check it out. Let's bring her with us. Okay, as much as I like Rigby, I don't think I'm going to use him for the entirety of this adventure, so... Rigby. The tribe has spoken. Look at the bright side. You managed to prove the Mordecai that your player won, so... That makes up for it. Yeah, I'll take your potion. Onward. Also, Wubat's evolution looks a lot like um, a Dorbat. That's why I wanted to name it that. So yeah. It's canon. Hey, it's that McDonald's guy. This Ronald McDonald motherfucker. Coming this way? I advise against it. Any trainer with a wishing star is in for a beating for me and my Pokemon. Too bad. You. You're the gym challenger endorsed by the champion, aren't you? What a joke. That chairman's a joke. You're aware that the chairman is more important than the champion, right? I was chosen by the chairman himself, so that makes me more amazing than you. I suppose I should prove beyond doubt just how pathetic you are and how strong I am. So allow me to cancel you. Bid. Bid, 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 bid. Okay, flame charge. My spell fame. I'm giving your Pokemon a little chance to shine, that's all. You're lucky it's not a fighting type. Super Fire Piss! Spit. Yep. 
It's Sasuke's fire jitsu move. Foreshadowing? I think not. Give me that's perk dark, I think will be fun. Found a kick! Again! No? Oh wait, it's also second as well. Yeah, I forgot. I forget, Eddie. Fire style! We can do this, Max. Just one more hit. Good job, little buddy. Die. Assurance. Pred's tail. Saving you 15% or 20% more on car insurance. Insurance, insurance. No. Okay, BF didn't do a whole lot of damage earlier, so we'll get rid of that move. Hatena. Let's use Matt. Never used him since he evolved. Time for the nut boy to fight. Oh dear. What have I been doing? Well, whatever. Wines and whatever. It's a party hat. It's party hat from Brawl the Objects. Holy shit. And he's a girl now. This is a good time to test what I'm having interest in lately. Uh oh. Okay, Razor Leaf. Ow! Looks like a Kirby enemy. Yeah, it kind of does. I see. Well, that's fine. Wasn't really trying all that hard anyway. My leg! Well, that was unexpected. I suppose you're more able than I thought. Naturally, I'll remember your battle style and strategies now. I'll be sure to easily defeat you, and if we ever face each other in an official match, I'll be sure to cancel you. Now that we established that, I won't waste any more time on you. I already gathered every single wishing star in this area. Now to go get some fucking McDonald's. I'm going to put two chicken McNuggets up my ass. You see those chicken nuggets now sticking up my ass. Pushing in and out at a medium pace. And the Coca-Cola bottle punched me in the face with it. Wait, is this a new route? Yeah, it is. Four. The most superior number of them all. What's over here? Oh. Okay, I thought that was an actual Pikachu for a second. Huh? What are you? The Alf. It's Bizarro Bling Bling Boy. Holy shit. Oh my god, I really like this design! Look at him! He's so fuzzy and stuff. I'm gonna try to catch him. Bizarro Bling Bling Boy goes for silver, not gold. Scratch! 
Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, I forgot Max was still in HP. I'm stupid. Okay, Dorbat. Time to make Mau Mau and Badger Clubs proud. Charm him. Oh, baka 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 charming! We'll do confusion because I feel like our curve is going to hit it harder. A big bushy beard. I'm beardy. Bing bling beardy. It is context sensitive for me to look like this. Okay, let's use a Premier Ball. Premier Ball, do your thing! Gotcha, yeah, hey! A horn cat? A Yeti? Or just a piece of shit? Oh, yeah, right, we already got me out earlier, but. <laughs> no Dr. Stinger entry for you! But anyway, um, we got a male Galarian Meowth. I kind of want to name it Beardy, but uh, I'm willing to hear some other names if you want to suggest any. I'll give y'all 30 seconds and then I'll move on. Got to keep the speed run going, guys. Got to move that gear up. Morgana. Werecat. Beardy's fine. Okay, then. <laughs> yeah, two people are saying Beardy. You don't have a beard. It's a part of my hair. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> I kind of want to bring it with us. Oh, man. <laughs> I really like the party I got now. I guess Polly could take a break for a while. Polly, the tribe has spoken. Oh, an electric! What's up? Wanna play? Yeah, it's just charging at me. Alright, we'll try to capture one of these things. Let's see how Beardy does. Oh my god, it is a beard! Look at that! <laughs> Wow. Bling Bling Beardy settles for silver, not gold. And he's dead! Okay, let's use Crunk. Crunkers rise up! Tasty electrics. Horny license time. We'll find that horny license item. I know it's in the game somewhere. Just don't know where it is. Okay, let's try to catch it. Pokeball, do your thing! Don't see your head, yeah! Okay, let's see what Dr. Stinger has to say about Electric. It stores electricity static in its fur for discharging. It gives off sparks if a storm approaches. Alright guys. 
We got a male electric. What are we gonna name him? I said, what are we going to name him? Sam? Yeah, 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 let's do Sam. Here we are, old friend. Together again. Through thick and thin. Let's always be friends. Send to the mouse box. <laughs> Let's go this way. I can't want to battle this Pikachu trainer. Can I catch you? What do you think? I look just like a Pikachu, right? Yeah, but are you a gallery in Pikachu? Because I'm pretty sure you are. Shane. Come back, Shane. My bus are plain. A Pokemon using a Pokemon against me. Geller sure is up top. Yep. Yeah. Oh, they made a new cry for Pikachu too. Did y'all hear that? That wasn't in 3DS games. Absorb can go because Mega Drain is just an improved version of that. We defeated Gallery and Pikachu! Pika! Let me catch you. Let me catch you. Too bad these Pokemon get in the way, but let me catch you! Probably a good strategy to distract you by having the thing both the trainer and the Pokemon or Pikachu. So you're not Gallery and Pikachu? Disappointed. Disappointed. I was so disappointed. Okay, looks like I can't go this way. I want to get the fuck out of here. Okay, also, we got to bring back some members back from the dead, so let's do that right now. Oh, cool, I got super fire energy. Maybe this will turn Krunk back into a human. Let's try it out. No. Oh, man, that sucks. Guess he got away a little longer, Krunky boy. Oh, we can go out this way. Man, this place is huge. Definitely one of the bigger routes I've visited so far. Oh, let's see if we can fish her. What can we fish here? Now remember, Billy. Oh boy, a magic carp. It's Kiki. That was a really menacing splash. Holy shit. I'm so scared. Uh, of Pokeball. Pokeball, do your thing. Let's do it. Yeah, hey. Okay, let's see what Dr. Singer has to say about Magikarp. It is virtually worthless in terms of both power and speed. It is the most weak and pathetic Pokemon in the world. Wow, this is the meanest entry by far. Well, at least we know the dark entries from Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon are kind of still here in some way. 
But anyway, um, we got a female Magikarp, so... What are we going to name her? Time to level grind for Big Dragonfish. Nope! This one's going straight in the Moz box. Useless. I am not naming it that. This fish deserves better. But not that kind of talk. Kick me. Well, y'all are mean. <laughs> the game is trying to cancel Magikarp. And here it is in the game. Salesman. I guess. Saleswoman. Dory. Nah, Dory will work. Up to the mouse box. You are not useless. Or pathetic. But I don't plan to use you anyway. Willow, where do you think you're going? Hop. Oh, you're not hop. Willow crashed into you and stopped. Ow, my face! My, are you okay? You took that tackle head on. Hmm, you must be one of those gym challengers, right? Indeed. I thought so. I saw you at the opening ceremony. My name is Milo. Milo Murphy. My memory saw is probably what caused my, my woo to crash into you. Sorry about that. I'm a gym leader at that rebel partial to grass type Pokemon. I've been interested to see just how good the champion endorsed gym challengers are. So let me find out at the gym stadium. Just head on straight through this route, and you'll run through my stadium. See you there. Yeah, hopefully the place doesn't fall apart given <laughs> Murphy's line shit. Come on now. Back to the stadium with you too. We can't keep the gym challengers waiting. Milo looks like Buck. He kind of does. Maybe Milo Murphy's his dad. Look, just take a look at that, Moz. Yeah, baby, take a good look. That's Turf Field Stadium down there. The gym leader just returned too. Milo Murphy's his name. It says Danny's he's just been giving it derp. But this place is jam-packed with challengers. It'll be ages before our turn comes up. Oh, but Susan Tess was looking for you, Mize. She wanted to ask you about something. She tried asking me, but I had no idea. I had no idea! She's up on that what's-her-face hill. On chef, what's-his-face hill? You know the one. What? You don't know the hill? Well, have a look at your map if you're not sure. Oh, if it isn't Susan's Yemper. He's a good boy. A good boy. He'll show you the way. Okay, at least let me heal my Pokemon first. The gates to Hell's Pokemon Center are open. Here I'm at the hospital! Okay, have a nice day! Good news, Moz. Your Christmas gift came in today. Really? I'm oh, looking forward to checking that out, Duke. Uh, thanks for letting me know. Definitely got me up again sometime. Hopefully in December we can do that. Block! Bow wow wow! Bow wow wow yippee yay yippee yay bow bow wow wow yippee yay! What's this? Three items that I'm never going to use! Cool! 
Can I have to sell this to the black market later? Thanks, Yumper. Oh, wow. I had you come because I wanted to hear what you thought. So that geoglyph, what do you think of it? Looks like that thing from Adventure Time, that's what it reminds me of. Darkest day. My perspective of you, especially since the ports and depicting the Black Storm has mostly disappeared. A long time ago, a great Black Storm covered the gallery region. Yeah, you already told me this story before. Too bad you get to hear it again. You're too bad. Giant Pokemon ran rampant. But what was that Black Storm they called? The darkest day. What connection does it have with the Dynamax? Guess I'm the lucky lady who'll be looking into that. Grand Shark gives me a lot to do. Thanks for your thoughts on the matter. Your thoughts on the darkest day. I think so. I'll give you a lead card. The Milo Murphy Yu-Gi-Oh card. Oh boy. I activated spell card Murphy's Law. Which means whenever you attack, bad shit will happen. Also, you lose 2,000 life points every turn. There's a reason why nobody uses in competitive Yu-Gi-Oh play. It's that, it's that overpowered and banned, just like Pot of Greed. My oath like grass type gym leader. Things will go well for if you use fire, flying, or bug type moves. Take these two. It'd be pretty bad if your Pokemon was in fine form. Just what I needed. Go on then, get yourself to Turfield Stadium and bow yourself silly. I will. Thanks. This doesn't feel like a city or town. Just like a route. Oh, what's over here? Cool. <gasps> Wait, we can probably evolve um a uh, a uh, Met. I think it involves using a leaf stone. Let's try it out. <gasps> yes, yes, yes. We're getting shift tree. Second stream, and we're already getting shift tree. So much evolution progress. Nice. Oh, uh, catch later, Duke. Let's see what Dr. Stinger has to say about Shift Tree. A Pokemon that was feared as a Forest Guardian. It can read the foe's mind and take preemptive action. Leaf Tornado. Sonic Tornado! Uh, we'll see with Rage the Leaf. He looks like Jiraiya. <laughs> yeah, he kind of does look like Jiraiya. Max now has a new mentor under his belt. It was fate that these two had mate. Yeah, Jiraiya is my favorite Naruto character. I love him. Okay, let's go challenge the gym, and then I think that might be it for tonight. We are over the two-hour mark, but I really want to do this tonight. So yeah, extra long stream tonight, because I love y'all. Take a look at this, boys. Yeah, baby, take a good look. The Grass Gym Badge. I got one try. I reckon I'm just about the greatest when it comes to wrangling Willow. In more ways than one. Will you ever stop up? No. I have plenty of practice at it all. After all, blah, blah, blah. but I'm sure you can win this one too. After all, you are my rival. Okay, let's go challenge. Let's begin our Bubble Bass challenge. It's Pokeball Guy again. Still don't trust you. Friend Ball. We are not friends. 
Or maybe you do, but I don't know for sure. I'm pretty sure Team Yell is lying behind my back that they're working for you. If you catch a Pokemon with a friend ball, it'll become friendly with you in no time. Just like how we became friends. When? Just now. Pokemons are just full of surprises, don't you think? Have some candy. Alright, let's just do a gym thing. Welcome, Gym Challenger. Allow me to help you with your registration. First things first. How about a quick refresher about the Gym Challenge? Or the Bubble Bass Challenge? We keep getting the names mixed up. Your goal as a Gym Challenger is to complete each gym mission, defeat every gym leader, and gather eight gym badges. Gym... missions? A gym mission is sort of a test you need to go through before facing the gym leader. Each gym has a different mission for challengers. So would you like to attempt the gym mission? Yes, I'd like to attempt the gym mission. If you'd like to attempt the gym mission, please change it to your own form. ch 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 change in Hop through his Wulu and Milo and won. <laughs> yeah, I can see that actually happening. Murphy's Law did it. Murphy's Law did it. Then let the gym mission begin. Give it your best shot. Give it all you got. Dance, dance, dance. Get to it. Take it to the tip. Leaf. It's the hidden leaf village. We finally found it, guys. The mission given by Turffield's Pokemon Gym is this. To chase our unruly Wooloo. To the blockade that we made from our bales of straw were there. Oh, by the way, you can call me Dan. You're not the Dan from Dan Versus. I serve as a referee. It's also my job to report the results of Battles to League HQ. Now let the gym mission begin. So it's like the tow mission from a... Uh, Paper Jam. Yeah, a lot of people were critical about those missions in Paper Jam, but I never found them that annoying. They were kind of fun. Uh, come on. Get in there! I'm Dan! I'm Dan. Stop it! Stop it! Oh, yeah, Ember's scaring it away. Uh, yo, stay away! Trying to do the gym challenge, the bubble bass challenge. Alternate name's sake. Please tell me you don't want to battle. Dang it. Welcome, Gym Challenger! Sorry, but I have to send you back in. It's been Jim. Samuel. Samuel Undertaker, holy shit! Fire style jitsu! Man, I'll do it. We defeated Samuel Undertaker. As expected, a gym challenger and the Pokemon are in perfect sync with one another. Yeah. Nice victory for him. Okay, I want to move him over here. Let's go this way. Onward. Oh crap, there's two of them. 
There's two of them up your ass. Okay, come on. We can outrun them. We can outrun them. Oh, crap. Uh, just look over there. Look over there. No, don't need to pay no attention to me. I'm not supposed to see your yamper. And sheep. The stream looped for me at the 2020 sign, and your voice made a perfect loop. Really? Weird. Okay, looks like we're doing the mission. Mission complete. So let's go up the stairs and go up the stairs and take on Milo Murphy. It says Jim and we're all bowing in it. Okay. Let's try to fight Murphy's Law. Steering contest. Actually, no. My gym's the first one people face, so we get a lot of challengers. That's why I tried to keep the gym mission challenging, but... That didn't stop me from completing it, Mars. Rapper job. Seems like you understand Pokemon really well. This is going to be a doozy of a battle. I'll have to Dynamax my Pokemon if I want to win. Watch this hope you don't damage the stadium. You are challenged by Milo Murphy. Okay, didn't expect that thing to be in an Ultra Ball. What the? Dynamax phenomenon. In the Galar region, Pokemon can become far larger than usual in certain places. Hint, hint. Get the hit. This transformation is called Dynamaxing. Press the Dynamax button when your Dynamax band lights up to Dynamax your Pokemon. Your Pokemon can only Dynamax for three turns. During that time, your Dynamax Pokemon can use extremely powerful moves known as Max Moves. These Max Moves not only deal tremendous damage, they can also trigger special effects. The exact effect changes depending on the type of Pokemon of move you use. Choose carefully when to Dynamax your Pokemon and smash away to victory. Choose carefully, Billy! Okay, there's only two Pokemon. Let's do some fire jitsu stuff first. Gotta boost the speed, Jay. Fire jitsu. There. Now we're gonna leave Max out. Woohoo! We're not gonna be done that easy. We're tough as weeds. Better bring my weed killer. Okay. It's time, Luigi! It's a Polygon Disco Ball! I guess you could say he Dynamaxed. Yeah! Come on then, it's Dynamax time! You're about to be schooled! Oh yeah! Watch, he's gonna throw that ball at a stadium light and gonna come crashing down the stadium. Okay, you just got lucky there. Lucky me! Oh my god, that was loud. My printers are bleeding, it hurts the printers. Bird! Super duper distortion fire jutsu! This 
This will really leave me in a shock, you know. It's our Dynamax move. Max Flare. It's in the name. It's my own special Jitsu. Again! God, that's loud. <laughs> Sorry for that, guys. We killed it! Good job, Max. We defeated Milo Murphy! The power of grass is wilted. What an incredibly challenging gym challenger! Max defeats the Elder Gods. Yup. That must be a fulfilling Pokemon battle for you. That's true that you defeated a gym leader for the gym challenge or Bubble Bash challenge. We really can't decide what to call this shit. But anyway, allow me to present you with your very own Grass Badge. A guy from the Urban Rangers. Moss is pleased! You can catch Pokemon up to level 25. Okay, so that's why I can't catch them. You need to obtain all the gym badges in order to complete the gym challenge. The only way to gather the badges is to defeat every single gym leader. Challenger Moz, my, my so sincere congratulations on defeating Milo Murphy. Please accept this TM to commemorate your victory. Please take this TM of my gratitude. Never misses. Hey, I'll teach, uh, met the... Don't know yet. Here. You can have Milo's uniform to go with it. It's a replica, of course. Oh, he has the same exact digits as I do! They're just numbered differently. Look at that. I have 318 and he has 831. Wow. So if I three Mars, the gym challenges has a set order you'll need to follow. So that means your next step should be in Holberry to meet Nessa. Holberry's just beyond Route 5. Or since you got the grass badge, you can head over to the wild area. It's a bit tricky to catch Pokemon that are higher level than the Pokemon on your team, but they need powerful allies if you succeed. Cool. Means let's head on out and heal up. But yeah, since one of my main goals for this stream was to take on the first gym, and now that we got our first badge, I think this is a good enough stopping point for tonight's stream, so, uh, let's see up at the hospital! And then I'll close things up for tonight. Okay, have a nice day! Let's walk outside and not sing! Because singing's all rated. But yeah. Here's let's save. Do a little double save. Hey, Savvy. <laughs> Sorry, man, but I've been streaming this for two and a half hours. Really gotta close things out. But yeah. Anyways, uh, in case anyone's curious, I do not see any art on Twitter right now, so... No fan art for tonight's stream, but... Yeah, alright. I got fan art last time I streamed this, which was last night. So that pretty much makes up for it. So, yeah. Anyways, that's about all there is for Pokemon Sword tonight. So... Thank you all very much for tuning to tonight's Pokemon Sword stream, everybody. Um, in case any people are new to these streams and like what you saw, everything that you see right here is everything that you need to know about me. And my streams in general, including where I post my streams a few days after they're broadcasted, 
and we're to submit fan art in case you guys got any art that you want to show on stream. Whatever games I'm currently streaming right now, and what do you get if you said to me on Twitch? And yeah, that's about the gist of it. So without all that all the way, thank you all ever so much again for tuning in to tonight's Pokemon Sword stream. And I'll catch you all again in the next one I do. With that, thanks again for tuning in, and have a good rest of the night, guys. It's been fun. Mozzie out.